real quick about the person you're going against. You don't seem like a smack talker kind of a guy, but do you uh, anything you want to say out there? Throw something out there. I've, I've made my I made a bunch of verbal jabs at this guy already. I think the guy. You know, he claims to be the best in, in the weight class being a grappler, and I think I'm the best in the weight class being the grappler. And um, I want to fight the best guy, so I called him out for for the challenge. He was, he was trying to avoid me for as long as he could. Oh, now he finally, to, uh, he finally has to he finally has to meet his maker. So, um, <laughs> you know, Wait, he, 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 he dates he dates oh, he dates Misha meet Tate. You know, <laughs> he meet, he dates Misha Tate. She's I think she's awesome. Nothing against her, but it's just like. Bro, how, how do you date a guy who just keeps turning down all these these fights? These guys have been calling him out, not just me. The entire division has pretty much called the guy out, and he just turns everybody <laughs> down. So it's like, I don't know how she, she puts up with that kind of stuff. That's why I call him Mr. Cupcake. But uh, <laughs> <laughs> it, it is it is what yes. it is, you know? It, I definitely yes. think he's a skilled opponent, but at the end of the day, I call I call it how I see it. So well, and so is it Mr. Cupcake with the sprinkles on top too? <laughs> with the sprinkles on top, <laughs> add a little cherry on there. Little for Hello too. Kitty like <laughs> <laughs> emblem well, on there. Al Jermaine, do you think he's getting some earned media just because of who he's dating? Is that part of it? Oh, 100 percent. I think he lives in her sh- he lives in his girlfriend's shadow, which is ridiculous. Like I understand if you d- did nothing in her field, then that's cool. But you do the same exact thing, and she's taking these tough fights, and you aren't. So it's like, what are you doing with your life? Like, come on, bro, make a name for yourself. So that's what kind of bothers me about that guy. Besides <laughs> that, I, I just want the challenge. That's 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 really what. My I want. God, this is amazing. I want to see you guys fight, but then I want to see your girlfriend and Misha fight. This is like a big family <laughs> thing now. This, I, I've told my like... girlfriend I throw a couple a couple combinations. So <laughs> <laughs> I, don't yeah, know, I don't know. I don't know if she can handle Misha though. But uh, I don't know. <laughs> Wait a minute. This is a brilliant idea. Intergender mixed. Martial arts fight. <laughs> what do you think? Hey, be quiet. We'll save it for UFC 200. We gotta oh, save yeah, that. Yeah, we gotta know, save yeah. it. We keep giving Dana White these million know, dollar ideas. One of these days, he'll take us up on it. Look, we <laughs> should we should mention. By the way, that is that is great smack talk. I mean, that is awesome. That's right the there. best we've had That's, in this. Studio. Honestly, it is. You went right after him. I love that. Yeah, it's, it's it's you know, like I said, I don't hate the guy. I just don't understand what he stands for. It's like he's bro, got the sprinkles on it, top, dog. You know I think what I mean? He's he's content with where he's at, and that's the, I think that's the difference between him and I. I'm hungry for this. I want to win the belt for myself. I think he's trying to find the easiest path to get there, path of least resistance. I, I'm I'm willing to take on all comers. So and you're ready to charge through walls. Yeah, absolutely. Right.